quoting Colin Hoover, New York Times and best-selling authors. We don't get to choose our parents and parents don't get to choose their children. But we do get to choose how hard we are willing to work in order to make the best of what we are given. See, no kids wants to be in a broken family. No kids wants to be abandoned by their parents. No kids wants to be transferred to different schools every single year. Do you think it's easy to be in a new environment constantly? New school, yay! New buildings, new teachers. Hope they will teach better here. New friends. Hmm. Cannot wait to have fun with them. And guess what's next? New boys. No one wants to meet them. Some might have the superpower to ignore them. Some might get depressed. Some even get suicide. But some survive and get success. Your past doesn't hold your future. Does your past determine your success? No. There was a boy who got beaten by the school bully at school and fell into coma for a week when he was just nine years old. Yes, you heard it right. Nine years old. Look, I couldn't believe what he had gone through to get success, but it's a real story. The story of Marshall Matters, or the world knows him as Eminem. Yes, success doesn't come in an easy way for most people, and those hardships could be the fudge for a long term of success. Well, let me describe his hardships. First, left by his dad when he was only six months. Second, he got transferred to new school twice a year because his mom couldn't hold her job. Third, he had to face the bullies, fell into coma, and left him to relearn more skills. Fourth, the constant bullying made him lose all interest in school and failed ninth grade three times and decided to drop out at the age of 17. The judgment of this kind of kid will be, hmm, drop out of school. How will he make a living? He's got nothing. No dad to support him. No education that could get him a job. Wow, this guy can get a success out of nothing. That's what I thought. But I forgot. Success doesn't come instantly. You must build it. Out of what? only out of the opportunity. Well, that's called luck. You cannot pull luck on your schedule. You have no control of luck. Eminem got lucky because he got Dr. Dre's attention. He got Dr. Dre's attention because he saw Eminem's talent. I believe that each of us is born with a gift. We can turn that gift into skills that others will see as a talent. His past was tragic, heartbroken, and emotional, but he used his past to grow stronger and do exceptional things. His past, skills, and determination get the world's recognition as a rap god. You can see it clearly in his lyrics, his controversial lyrics, humorous mythic with his poetic and rhyming skills. Can you? have success in your life. Yes, how? By keep fighting for your dreams, even if you have to face millions of obstacles. The obstacles that make you an achiever. Does your past define you? No, what you do now define you. I am Miss Aurelia and I have one last question for all of you before I end my speech. If you had one shot or one opportunity to seize everything you ever wanted in one moment. Would you capture it or just let it slip?